back at it with another reaction. What's going on, everybody? It is time to watch something rated JG with me, John G. Uh, El Camino, it's out in a couple of days. One of the biggest Netflix movies to be dropping all year, part of the Breaking Bad series. And they just have a behind the scenes look, so we're gonna take a look right now. New reactions every single day, and we ain't stopping. Let's go. Jesse Pinkman. I knew that this story started with where we left off in Breaking Bad, but I had no idea where it was heading. This is very much a Breaking Bad movie. It feels a bit like Old Home Week. It feels a bit like Deja Vu. And yet it also <laughs> feels like something fresh and new. Aaron getting to star in his own movie, the Jesse Pinkman story post Breaking Bad. I've been looking forward to doing this for years. It's just so strange to see the script in hand and it just said vince gilligan special project vince did such an excellent job at the end of breaking bad but i really felt like there was one story that was not fully explored and that was jesse's i think the story of this film is really about the struggle to survive you know follows a man on the run who will truly stop at nothing to finally become free Oh, yeah. Skitty Pete! So good, like how close he is. You could feel it. Obviously, we thought this thing was done, but it still very much lives and breathes in all of us. It was worth the 21 takes, to tell you that. So much time had passed, but we're all still so close, and so there's just like old friends coming together. It's like coming home. It was like uh, going back to your high school reunion if your high school sold meth. <laughs> Okay, pictures up, here we go. Bad badger. Bad action. I think all of our fans will just be so thrilled to see this next chapter. I think it really gives some closure for this character. Draw. You ready? Yeah. Perfect. Done Netflix. All right, so a little behind the scenes, showing a couple places uh, out in the desert again. You know, we saw Jesse running through out in the city. Um, possibly, I wonder what he's digging. I wonder what he's digging up right there. Like, yeah, that looks like it's the same. It's part of the same scene. Um, there's some hair right there. That's definitely hair. So I wonder. Who Jesse is building a a grave for? So I guess we'll have to find out. You guys, let me know in the comments below who you think Jesse Pinkman ended up killing or taking out or having to dig a body for. Obviously, that's hair right there, so that has to be. But um, I'm excited for it. I'm happy that they did a movie for this, not like a series or anything. Because with Breaking Bad, I feel like it was so perfect that you know. Another series doesn't need to be made. I know they did Better Call Saul and uh, stuff on the side, but um, I really think that a movie is justice for their story. Uh, I would like to see a series for maybe someone like Gus, maybe, but that's about it. Like that would be the only other thing I'd want to see is like Gus's like true like series stories. I know they they touched a little bit of it on like Better Call Saul and stuff like that, but. I would really love for them to do their own uh, series for Gus, but you guys let me know in the comments below who did Jesse end up killing right there or possibly killing and digging a burial for throwing him out in the desert. Post in the comments below and hey, reactions every single day. Hit the bell, hit the sub, specifically that sub. We're trying to get to that first milestone or 1K subscribers. I would love it if you guys would be a part of the journey. Take care and be easy.